Greetings world. We are anonymous. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us. The Calgary Stampede Foundation is being hit with a class action lawsuit. In a statement of claim filed last year and amended in January, the victim's lawyers are seeking court approval to launch a class action lawsuit against the accused and the foundation, which operates the school. You have to be employed by the Calgary Stampede in order to be an employee for the Calgary Stampede Foundation. The claim alleges the accused, who worked for decades with the school, breached his duty as an educator by sexually abusing the students and alleges the foundation is vicariously liable because they were aware of his conduct. The young Canadians had actual knowledge of his inappropriate conduct allegations of sexual assault and sexual exploitation with respect to some of the class members as a result of one or more complaints made by one or more faculty members of the young Canadians, reads the claim. Earlier this year the CEO of the foundation said it had no knowledge of the sum of the allegations in the lawsuit and refuted others. Just like explained in a previous video exposing the Calgary Stampede, the supervisors and higher-ups all look out for each other. The lawyers representing the victims encourages other victims to come forward confidentially to be part of the class action against the accused and the Calgary Stampede Foundation. The lawyer's statement is similar to the claims we made in exposing the truth about the Calgary Stampede video. The lawyer of the victims says that he is very disappointed that the Stampede has responded to the sentencing of the accused by asserting that they provided support to the young victims after the arrest. We expect the evidence to establish that the Stampede did not provide them with appropriate support and assistance including the counseling that they needed and that they continue to need. A number of our clients have been utterly devastated, and they have ongoing needs for support that have simply not been met. Some of our clients have received no support from the Calgary Stampede Foundation. The Stampede's response avoids taking responsibility for its own failure to protect our clients left in their care and for the actions of its own senior employee. See the similarities to what was said in our video. The victims of who launched a class action lawsuit against the Young Canadians and the Calgary Stampede Foundation in April 2017, which was amended in January, claims the Young Canadians failed to adequately supervise the accused employee and failed to establish implement or enforce adequate policies, practices or procedures to protect the class members against child sexual abuse or exploitation by staff of the Young Canadians. It also alleges that the Young Canadians failed to adequately investigate and act with respect to his sexual exploitation and inappropriate conduct. The Calgary Stampede Foundation did not immediately respond to requests for comment. Just like the previous video said about them, they do not respond to anyone, not even their own employees' complaints or suggestions. We are anonymous. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us.